Calabi-Yau manifolds. The important part of Calabi-Yau manifolds are how they apply to string theory. The importance of string theory is that quantum mechanics and Einstein's theory of relativity are contradictory to each other. Thus, we do not have a true form of uh, mathematically ap approaching gravity. So, does gravity even exist? Yes, it is through string theory. For in string theory, the difficulty is it requires Ten, a minimum of 10 dimensions, which are the three spatial dimensions, plus the dimension of time, and then six additional dimensions. However, the current theory posits 11 dimensions, and Bosnick string theory, which uh, g g attempts to get rid of ghost states in quantum mechanics by adding 26 dimensions instead of 10. Uh, the key part of, th of string theory is Instead of assuming molecules as particles, it is assuming them as strings. It can, they can be open strings, which are just like this, or a closed string. Uh, the strings are parameterized by the sigma, uh, by sigma, and their position in, uh, the position of a spring, a string is given by x. The change in a, uh, in a, in a string's position is given by this equation, which is uh, the second derivative of x with, uh, respect to time, the second, uh, minus the second derivative of x with respect to its length, or uh, sigma, and that'll equal zero. Uh, the total energy of a spring is, uh, string is given by this equation, or this integral. However, at uh, uh, here, r is equal to zero. At, when it equals zero, uh, this integral diverges. As such, we need to uh, close the string by cutting it off at LP, which is a parameter applied to the string. Uh, the importance of a manifold in this is that a manifold is a topological space in which you can, at a relative point, you can see uh, a line. Uh, for example, allow us to take a parabola. At, a, at this relative point, you could take a line, otherwise known as the derivative. For the Earth, a sphere is a two-dimensional manifold. If you looked at a relative point of the Earth, you could see a two-dimensional uh, space. So the Calabi-Yau manifold is a 10-dimensional space, or it is a six-dimensional manifold, which means it has 10 dimensions, which we can then apply to string theory. Uh, the manifold is given by the color metric, which is given here, uh, with these stipulations, uh, the energy of this ma of sh string theory through this manifold is given uh, by the Mong Ampere equation given here, which is the derivative of phi with respect to uh, d z i d z bar j, uh, to the to the j, where it is fulfills these stipulations. Uh, one of the proof given for the uh, Calabi-Yau manifold, given by Yau, was this here. There are then 10 more, there, there are then four, uh, like 12 more pages or something of like proof, and I cannot be bothered to do that.